is back. Hit it. Ha. Hit it. Hit it. Ha. Oh, God. Attention successful people. Entrepreneur Nate Brown has a special offer just for you. His book, The Laws of Success, will get you back on the path to achieving your dream. I've left the link at the top line of the description box right now. I need everybody under the sound of my voice to go show my man some love. He has my personal endorsement. All right, man, your boy Kodak Black pleaded guilty to his whole sexual assault conduct case yesterday now after the news dropped early yesterday you know people started going in on who that black pretty much on twitter on facebook instagram saying look how the heck are you going to plead guilty to uh pretty much what it uh equates to a rape case and um that pretty much means you did it well kodak black actually fired back and here's what he said yesterday he put um or today i should say he put um Ain't got to register as a sex offender or nothing. Shit, that's a play if you ask me. LOL, got me effed up. And I ain't that freaking homie. Five years later, both of us wanted to get this shit over with. And I ain't have to come up with no money. Now, again, again, as a result of the plea deal, because he did plead guilty. But he pleaded guilty to the lesser charge. charge. He was given a 10-year suspended prison sentence and is placed on 18 months of probation and he won't, will not have to wear ankle monitor, but he must, like most people on probation, or all people I should say, visit his probation officer, let him know where he lives and where he goes. So he'll still be kind of one foot in, one foot out, and he will not be allowed at this point in time to use any drugs, drink alcohol, or have any guns as he completes his probation term now remember this incident went down in february 2016 where the alleged victim pretty much claimed that the florida rap star raped her in a hotel room after his performance in south carolina now again him and the victim they came up with an agreement he pleaded guilty to the lesser charge and um you know that is what it is now the lesser charge is first degree assault and battery and initially, he was facing up to 30 years in prison. That sentence was taken down to 10 years. And he, again, he was given a suspended sentence of 18 months of probation. And now, like he said, he won't have to register as a sex offender. So that's the best possible scenario. I can remember probably six months ago, he was in prison. He was going through it. He was getting, you know, that, that treatment that most people get in prison. He was crying out. And it looked like this dude was going to at least do five to ten years. So this is nothing but a blessing for Kodak Black. Another lease on life for the young man. Hopefully, hopefully he takes this as a second chance and does right and tries to stay out of the system and stay out of frivolous cases like this, man. So shout out to Donald Trump, you know what I mean, for um pardoning him and whatnot, but the rest is up to him at this point. I mean, you ain't going to have nobody. That's the once in a lifetime thing. Everybody ain't going to get no Donald Trump pardoning them. You know what I'm saying? But we'll see, man. But definitely wish the best for Kodak Black going on, you know, here forward. And that's what you have it, man. The Hip Hop Uncensored podcast. Hip Hop News Uncensored exclusive. It's your boy, Oh God, man. Make sure I hit the like button. Make sure I share the video. Over and out. Peace. Bars is back. Hit it. Hit it. Oh God, what's up with you? Hip Hop Uncensored is the vibe, so subscribe. Hip Hop Uncensored is the vibe, so subscribe. Oh God, driving Sam and riding passenger side. And you heard it out the mouth of the greatest rapper alive. Interested in promoting your brand, business, or talent on Hip Hop News Uncensored? Hit me up right now at advertise at hiphopun.com. That's advertise at hiphopun.com. Hit me ASAP. Very affordable rates now to our regularly scheduled program. Let's